Tonight, we're digging into Flannery Associates. The firm purchased 55,000 acres of farmland in Solano County, including right near Travis Air Force Base. Now, that's nearly double the size of San Francisco. Yet no one, not even the federal government, can figure out who's behind it. And more importantly, why? Federal officials say a mysterious company has purchased nearly $1 billion of land surrounding Travis Air Force Base, one of the most critical military bases in the western U.S. Democratic Congressman John Garamendi raised the alarm to the U.S. Air Force, prompting a federal investigation. In your briefings on the matter, do you have any reason to believe the purchase of this land is for spying? I have every reason in the world to believe that this land is in an area in which spy operations or any other nefarious activity could take place that could detrimentally impact the ability of Travis Air Force Base to operate in a moment of national emergency. Public records show the company, Flannery Associates LLC, began purchasing the land in 2018, and investigators say those acquisitions ramped up this year. But now literally three sides of that base is totally controlled by the Flannery Group. Nobody knew who they were. Who are these people? Where did they get the money that they can pay five to ten times the normal value that others would pay for this farmland? Eight months of investigation, yet... We do not know where this money is coming from. Do you have any reason to believe China is tied to this group? I have reason to be concerned. Garamendi says an attorney representing Flannery Associates indicated the firm is made up of a group of families, 97% of whom are allegedly American, looking to diversify their portfolio from equities to real assets, including agricultural land. But the congressman is skeptical. Well, we have heard scheme after scheme that makes no sense at all. Uh, we're going to build a deep water port, really, around Travis Air Force Base, which is 10 miles from the bay. Uh, we're going to uh, farm. Well, at that price, you're going to lose a lot of money farming. Uh, we're going to build a city. No, you're not going to build a city here for all kinds of reasons. Uh, so none of the uh, reasons why the land is being acquired make any sense at all. What do you think is happening? I don't know. According to Garamendi, Flannery Associates has also acquired land around the interstate electrical grid system, all the way from the Columbia River into central California. This includes land that houses wind turbines that provide significant power into northern California. It's the secrecy here. What's going on? If you're not a nefarious operation, why are you keeping it secret? Now the I-team has reached out to the attorney representing Flannery Associates for further comment, but we're still waiting to hear back. In the meantime, Garamendi says this continues to negatively impact the farming community in Solano County. He says at least 10 landowners are currently being sued by Flannery, accused of being engaged in a, an illegal scheme to prevent Flannery from buying their land. So this continues. There's a lot of moving parts here. That is the strangest thing. What a mystery. It is bizarre. Yeah. Cool. Thank you, Stephanie.